Y'all really did it. Y'all really blew up the like button for the Fight Like Sanji video. So it's only fair that I hold up my end of the bargain. And in this video, I'll be breaking down the exact fighting moves done by the straw hat black leg Sanji and telling you how to do them. What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing aviators and a superhero hat, and welcome to the Modern Ninja. And for those of you that don't know, this video is a kind of a part two for my Fight Like Sanji video. Sanji is the chef of the Straw Hat Pirates on the show One Piece. A fantastic anime if you haven't watched it, so definitely check it out. And in that video, I break down his entire fighting style and show you how you can recreate it with real life martial arts. Diablo Jumbo! But like I said in this video, I'm going one further and breaking down specific moves he does in the show and showing you how to do them in real life. This is the first time I've ever done a video like this, so if you want me to do more of Sanji or another character that I've covered in my Fight Like a Superhero series, definitely let me know down in the comments. And if this video hits 50 likes again, I'll do another one just like this. But without further ado, let's jump into Sanji's first move. The Collier. Now I'm gonna be honest, I can barely pronounce English words, so if I pronounce it really, really badly, I'm sorry, I, I can't speak French. But I can translate French. It is a French word meaning neck meat. Sanji delivers a powerful round kick to the opponent's neck. And the coiler shoot is just adding a jump during this move. You're really gonna need flexibility to get your leg up high enough to actually hit someone's neck and make sure you rotate your bottom foot so that you can get full power and rotation into your kick. The second move is the epulet, a French word meaning shoulder. <laughs> This is an axe kick coming down with the heel onto the shoulder or collarbone of your target, often knocking them down or even breaking their collarbone. This is actually a super devastating move in real martial arts. And so if you can master this axe kick, you can, you can break people down. Just make sure to hit with your heel because if you don't, you're gonna end up hitting with either your Achilles tendon and that will hurt, I promise, I've done it. Or you'll end up hitting with your toes and that really won't do much damage to your opponent. And the Epule shoot is just adding a jump to your axe kick. If you haven't seen the pattern yet, adding a shoot to your move is just jumping and doing the same thing. Move number three is the Cotele. It's a French word meaning rib. <laughs> This move is actually a capoeira move, going into a handstand and spinning for a hook kick again to the ribs. Hence, you know, the name of the move. You're going to want to make sure you use your heel for your impact and that will give you the most penetration, allow you to break the most ribs possible. Move number four is sim, a French word meaning lower back meat. <laughs> This move is actually used in combination with the last one we did, Kotele, building off of the momentum of that attack. Still in that handstand position, you're gonna bounce off of the hook kick and spin into a roundhouse kick. And the fifth and last move we're gonna be going over today is to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss my next video. I mean, that's not the actual move, but you should still do that. The actual last move is Potrine, meaning breast meat. <laughs> This is a front kick to the opponent's chest, using the ball of the foot or heel to push the target back and making space for future attacks or a better defense. And of course, adding in the shoot is just adding in a jump. And with that, you have five Sanji moves to go home and practice in your backyard. And if you want even more things to practice in your backyard, make sure to keep an eye out for the Become a Ninja staff course, designed to take you from zero never touching a bow staff before in your life, to, to 60 being comfortable with any staff in your hand. Able to do many of the strikes, blocks, and spins that you see me do on this channel. 
And of course, I have to say, hit me with that HBO special, as in help a brother out and drop a like, a comment, and subscribe so you see more of my videos in the future. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore, this is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out. If you like this video, check out the original Black Leg Fighting Style Breakdown video, or this one about another fellow straw hat from One Piece, Brooke. Either way, I'll see you guys in the next one.